Hello there, thank you for joining me. Here we are back in Satisfactory. I hope you're well, I hope you're having a lovely day. Oh dear, what a day it's been. Okay, right, so we have completed this little kind of production area here. It's all turned off at the moment. Um, I need to connect one of these to there, I think. And then it'll power on. So here we go, watch the power die. We run out of power now. Anyway, so we've got four coming in here. It feeds into these machines. If they were told what they're doing. Um, then it comes out as iron ingots, as you can see, in various guises. They all go into machines that are all doing different things. So we've got, I think we've got steel sheets, uh, screws and iron rods and then they come out hopefully with a bit of luck and a following wind I'll see, oh there we go, some iron rods going that way screws coming out this way, there we go and then over here we've got sheets right, so sheets go in here with the screws and then they get turned into reinforced sheet. Reinforced sheet goes into this machine here. And this is taking rods in, I think. There we go, so rods there as well. They go into here, and it's making modular frames, yay! Right, so, it's not very efficient. In fact, it's not efficient at all. So not very efficient, but it's doing it. Uh, it's 100%. That's right, it is efficient. Just started this way. Anyway, so then it sends them out down here. And they go along here, all very, very slowly. And they go all the way along here. And then... They head towards this here assembler. And the assembler, with its frames, is putting together these versatile frameworks. And the versatile frameworks are going down here. And they're joining in with this here. It's going into our space elevator, which you can see at the top right. We've 692 of the thousand, so we're not doing too badly. We are getting there. Albeit very slowly, but we are getting there. I could go about overclocking things and stuff, but I haven't done. Now this over here isn't very efficient. Bless it. It's all, all backed up. It says 100%, so it is doing 100%. It's just this. When you're putting out like 15 a minute. And this requires 30 minutes to be 100% efficient. So, and I can't really do anything about it because of the whole input, really. Oh, that's got a bit more efficient now. Hmm. Maybe I can do something about it. Just on the cusp, isn't it? Don't seem to gain any. Mm. So close, and yet so far. So yes, I can't really overclock it. A little less doing stuff. So yeah, so I need steel beams in order to do the blueprint designer, but I've not really collected anything yet. 
I'm just letting it do its own thing. I could do. Could grab some steel beams and some concrete, I suppose. Stop. But I don't think the other. I don't think. Yeah, I think my steel beam production has stopped now. Uh, how many do I need? 30. Oh, I've just taken them all. Not bad. Now I do uh, just need concrete, so let's go grab some concrete and then we'll get our blueprint designer. I need to go back and do repowering of the coal. So I'll need some fuel for that. There we go. I can make a blueprint now. Blueprint designer. Excellent. So where am I gonna do my blueprint designer? That's the question. Um, I'm kind of being marked over here, really. Oop. At the end of that rock that points up. Maybe I'll do that. Let's have a look. Production, foundation, some of that. Let's see if that's big enough for our blueprint designer. Just about. Once you have built a satisfactory blueprint, interact with the blueprint designer terminal to save it. It will then be available in the blueprints tab of your build menu. Blueprints can always be edited to correct mistakes or optimize. If you find yourself struggling to work within the set size restrictions, remember that this is a you problem, and efficiency can always be improved. This is a you problem. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> mm. Alright. So we've got a lookout now, so we should be able to go up here. And we can see down on it. Fantastic. Seems bigger. One, two, three, four. No, it's still four by four. <laughs> okay. There is an upgrade. You can get an upgrade for it if you make it five by five. But uh, four by four seems plenty at the moment. So we've done that. That's fantastic. Right, so let's go grab some. Get some power going, don't we? Ah. So we'll go for a run along here.
and my belt's all empty here yeah, because well that's something I'm going to mention I died <laughs> I was building this and it goes through um, gas cloud and I ended up dying as you do trying to collect some material so we can make some fuel so we can power our coal steel production plant this the power down that's okay let's just run up here excuse me guys and over here and let's do some of this biomass stuff actually before we do that I've got 16 on me I've been playing for four hours it says I have been playing for four hours you're right but that's okay, because that's how the videos get made. Right, there we go. Let's grab some of these. Right, okay, I will be back in a moment when I've got some more fuel. Okay, right, so that's that done. Uh, I've got 200 now, that's enough. We've got 280, but it's enough to do that. Okay. Whee. Right, so we need to put some in here. And we need to put some in here. And turn them back on again. There we go. Right. I forgot there was two generators down there, and I'm sitting there wondering why it powered off. Anyway, there we go. We're back up and running again. I could, I could overclock this one. Hmm. Worth doing though. Got two hundred to get. We get a shard. Have I got a shard. I'm sure I made a shard earlier. Where it went though. Looks like it forgot back. Yeah. 
Tell me I've got enough to make another. Another one of these, have I? Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. That's what I have. That's worth doing. See if it overclocks now. Capacity for 90. Not too bad. Must have been just about over. Hmm. Kicking them out. It's, it's, it's got two ball feet. Oh, going through it well, doesn't it? Ooh, it's exciting. Anyway, that's going to run for a little while because this has only got leaves in it. Well that's not great. I suppose I better make some more. Leave it doing that for a bit. Oh, I don't know. Three hundred and forty eight to go, okay. Well I'm gonna leave it doing that for a bit and I will return. See you in a moment. Okay then, that's that done. Right, you are. So, how are we getting on down here? Still going? Swap those over. Uh, put those in there. Top them up. In there. Right, that's that one. Okay. What am I doing next? I've got 874, 75, 76, versatile. Uh, versatile framework done. And that's good. So we just need to do, we'll see what the next goal is, I suppose. I'm not sure this is quicker anymore. I'm sure it slows down, like they fixed it. It used to be quicker to slide and jump, and now I'm not so convinced it is. Sure. Not sure at all. Probably not as quick as the buggy, but I haven't done the buggy yet. <clears throat> so we're quite close to getting the next objective done for the old space elevator. See what other milestones we've got that we can unlock. Oh, can't walk under there. <laughs> that one. Logistics. We could do the logistics. We need to be really farming out steel beams, wouldn't we? Hmm. Five tubes. 
Get some transport. Hmm. Not really played with that yet. Sure, someone said that the trains were going to be in tier four, but they're not. I guess they got that wrong. Is it worth doing this? I suppose it's not too much, is it? It depends on how many of these. Hundred in there. Oop. Keep walking the things. Two hundred in there. Okay, we've got two hundred. I suppose we could put them in there. Loads more coming, but that's actually the steel rods, the uh, iron rods. Hmm. Need to up our production of these beams. kind of have with this. This is doing it 100% efficient. And I suppose it is getting to that point now where Should be coming in relatively quickly. What well, it would be if I could upgrade all the belt to two. I can't. It's only on one at the moment. Well, mostly this bit's Mark Two. <clears throat> so I don't really know. It's only fifty efficient. I want 30 but this is only kicking out at 15 I think. Yeah. Tricky. I'm trying to work out what's best to do. I'm running a thousand or oh, hundred away from having these. There's another four. I'm just wondering whether or not it's worth doing anything else. That's all looking really. This is producing quite well now, I think. But quite a backlog. But it's not getting in there as a backlog then. I'm not quite sure why that is. Because that little bit of belt's really slow. Hmm. Don't know. Just trying to figure out whether it's worth making another one. Probably is. Actually, 
Mark one. Ray belt mark two. Okay, it's Mark II. It all seems to be Mark II, okay. I'll we'll replace that with a splitter and put another one of these in there then. some power on it. Um, it's got lots going in there now. should get twice as much. Okay. Hmm. A little bit too late, but never mind. <laughs> I only need like 60 odd left to do that. Like that. Oh well, it is what it is. Struggling to keep up. That's all right, I don't mind. This has got plenty going on. I'll nick those. And we'll stick them in our collection. Okay, so we're getting there. So we've only got another 60 or 70 odd to go. There's your positive music again. I like the music, it's great. Uh, anyway, right. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you ever so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. Do let me know what you think in the comments. Obviously, I'm Spaghetti Master. But it's alright. I mean, it's on foundations and things. That's like better improvement from last time. In the next episode, we might have a bit of a play on the old Blueprint Factory. Although, I need to unlock the next sort of milestones, really. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I will see you then. Thanks for joining me. See you soon. Bye.